All right, Assalamualaikum and good morning. I'm Dr. Hyrule. So I would like to explain to you about your assignment. Okay, ECE 222, Creative Art, Movement and Music. So uh, this is your assignment. Okay, this is your assignment. Firstly, uh, make sure eh, it's very important for you. Right? Use your own words. If you copy and paste from the other learning material, it will be uh, deduction eh, uh, on certain marks. But please be honest. Okay, you can do that with your own words only. Okay, if you want to find it from the other sources, make sure you write in your own words. Okay, for the format, remember for the format, your assignment, you need to write in New Times Roman, size 12, uh, one half spacing for, uh, on A4 paper. And please remember, make sure you have a soft copy, uh, you have soft copy of your assignment safely stored in your computer. Okay, so uh, this is a very important part, remember. Then this is your cover page. Uh, for your assignment, okay. Make sure you use the same cover page, cover a uh, cover page, okay. Write the assignment May twenty twenty semester, okay. Subject code ECE two two two. Subject title Creative Arts, Music and Movement. Program Graduate Diploma. Make sure you write your name, your metric number, your academic facilitator, your learning center, and if you don't mind. Okay, you write your active email. Make sure your active email, if anything happened to your assignment, okay, so the, uh, academic, your academic facilitator can, can contact you. All right, there are four parts in your assignment. Okay, part A is about 15 marks. You just write in four pages. And the purpose of this part A is to assess your ability to comment on a research article. Okay, I think you, every, everyone uh, has been exposed to this uh, research article comment. I think it's common to you. Okay, read the article, what young children say about art. Okay, a comparative study by Felicity McAdles uh, and Kit May Betty Wong. Okay, it is attached with your assignment. Okay. Just read two or three times to you to understand uh, the content of the uh, of the uh, research article. Okay, what you need to do first, okay, introduction, okay, and then finding and then conclusion. Okay, for introduction, one page only. Okay, you just write about one page about the purpose of the study, the sample, who did the author study how the author collects the data, and then finding for the finding part, 2.5 pages, only eight marks, okay? What the children in the study say? Okay, you need to read the, the conversation, the, 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 the whole article so that you can understand, okay? Then the conclusion is about half page, two marks only, what did the author say about their study, okay? So, I already uh, give you this, the, this format for you to understand better, right? The introduction you need to to know the purpose of the study. So where you, where you can find it, it is in the abstract, okay? And then the the article, the author, and then the sample who is the respondent of this uh, assignment and data collection. You need to know how is the research being conducted. So you need to know the methodology. You need to know where the study took place. You need to know what the author use for data collecting. What is the instrument? Is it a uh, checklist? Is it a uh, uh, what uh, survey? It is. Uh, it is uh, what uh, interview right? and so on. Okay. Then how the author organize the data? Okay. You need to know that, and you write in introduction part. Okay. You just write about how many pages? Four pages only. Okay, then you need to write about two and a half pages for the finding. Okay, uh, it consists of eight marks. What did 
the children in the study say. Okay, describe all the data and refer to the objective of the study. Remember, every academic uh, research paper, it has the, their own objective study. So you need to know that thing. You need to know why the author conduct the study, conduct the research. Okay, for this paper, okay, I will, I will explain to you later. Okay, then the conclusion part is about half of page. What did the author say about their study? Okay, all right. So this is your uh, article. Okay, remember I said abstract. Okay, this is the. Okay, this this is the the title. The title. Okay, what young children say about art. A comparative study by these two people, okay, from the Queensland University of Technology and Kit May Betty Wong from the Hong Kong Institute of Education. All right, abstract, okay, introduction. Okay, remember, I always uh, find that students they copy the introduction, everything in the introduction please remember you must write in your own words you just refer to what to the powerpoint that i give you i give you just now okay so this is the background of the study okay why the uh, why why the the study uh, needs to be needs to be to be uh find it again needs to be uh, what conduct in the society okay then Okay, this is about the study. Okay, so I think you can you can find it eh? uh, from the data analysis. Okay, All right. So for part B, fifteen mark, write about four to five pages only. The purpose of part B is to assess your ability to observe and write a report about creative movement and dance in your school. Okay. Okay for Part B, okay, just write a report. Uh, just write a report. There is no, uh, there is no format for report, but you you can refer to any report. You can Google any report format for you to 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 write. Okay, for you, for you to refer. Okay, creative movement and dance in my school. How creative movement and dance are adopted? Okay, maybe you took from the you adopt from from the YouTube. Okay, or you create your own. Okay, how frequently is creative movement and dance is done? Okay, you can refer to your timetable. You can refer to your manual, your school manual, and material equipment made available. Okay, how you use the material and equipment uh, for your dance, for your creative, for your uh, uh, dance class. Okay, and what is your reaction of the children based on your general observation? Okay. We know uh, now uh, many schools, right? all, all preschools are been closed, okay? But you can write, depends on your experience. I think all of you are already an uh, experienced teacher, so you know. You can, you can, uh, you can uh, flash back what you have done in your school, okay? Just write a report, okay? Remember report, there is no format for the report, but you can choose any format uh, from any reference, so it doesn't matter. As long as you write how you create the dance, uh, how you how you use the materials, okay, uh, and then uh, how it is the lessons. And the important part is what is the children reaction? Okay, are they happy? Are they join it? Uh, the, the 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 lessons, okay, happily. Okay, you can use your own word to 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 uh, to what to to write the report. Okay, then for the part C, only about two pages. Why it is important to teach musical skills and concept in early childhood? Write a letter. Okay, write a letter to the families in your class, explaining why music activities should be an important part of the curriculum and support your argument with the research evidence. All right. Firstly, is a uh, write a letter. Write a letter mean formal letter. Okay, remember formal letter. If you couldn't remember what is a formal letter, you can find it in the Googles. Okay, make sure you 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 choose the correct uh, 
uh, format for the formal letter. Okay, you can use your school letter head, it doesn't matter. Okay, okay you write to the families in your class and you, you tell them why the music activities is very important. Okay, why it is important for the, uh, for the children, socialization, for the children, uh, improve, improvement means that the kinesthetic area, you know, you can refer to the it's uh, Gartner uh, intelligence, okay, for that thing. And why uh, an activity should be important part of the curriculum. This is one of the curriculum, uh, preschool curriculum. So you, you need to explain it to the parents, to the family, and then give support your, your argument. Okay, I would like to choose you to, to, to find in the, in, in, in uh, article or in a textbooks okay, you can you can find it in the, in the googles okay, by the, by clicking the uh, by click to the uh, uh, musical skills and concept in early childhood why it is important you can find a lot of sources and remember don't copy and paste right in your own words right and support your argument with our research evidence okay so that is uh, for the part c and the last part is part d you determine the number of pages. I don't mind you write how many pages, but please uh, be rational for 20 months. Okay, the purpose of this assignment is to assess your ability to design and implement a lesson for teaching drawing to children. Okay, you want to teach drawing, uh, how, you want, how you conduct the drawing lesson. Okay. Your task design about 30 minutes lesson using the following format. Okay, use this format or any format. If you have the more suitable format, it's up to you. Okay, you can use your own uh, school format. It doesn't matter. Okay, format and that you can. Uh, uh, and this format is only the basic format, and it's up to you. You want to choose or not? Okay, but uh, uh, it's, uh, it is up to you. Uh, and you know you comfort with any formats okay the important part the important thing is in the format uh, the subject what is the subject okay and then the day and date the class the time the topic the content standard please refer to the uh, to the KSPK and learning standard and objective you need to write the the, the objective okay then Okay, teaching aids, what is the teaching aids? Okay, then the procedure. Okay, maybe you can write step one in the procedure. Okay, what teacher will do and then what people will, will do. Step two, what teacher will do, what, what the, 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 the student, yeah, the people will do. Okay, and then up to you, uh, maybe four or five uh, procedure. Okay, then the closure. How do you determine people's uh, understand the lesson? Okay, this is important. Uh, I think as, a, as, as an experienced teacher, this doesn't matter. It doesn't. Uh, it is not difficult for you to write the uh, what the, the lesson notes. Okay. Remember, you can refer to any lesson notes. Okay. Then teach the lesson. You need to teach the lesson. Okay. Make sure and uh, make your lesson interesting as possible as you can. And then the important part is be creative. Okay. Include the photograph of your lesson and include it in the in your assignment okay make sure you take few few photos don't, don't take too, too much okay two uh, two three is already enough and include photograph of the teaching aids okay uh, what they use what you use for your uh, for your uh, lesson and include the reflection about two pages okay you need to write the reflection reflection mean after you teach okay everything done and then you reflect what is happening what is happened while you are te while you are teaching okay and then tell how feel about the lesson do you think it is went well or not and then you give some explanation uh, was there something you could have done better you give some explanation how could you have done it in another way maybe you can reflect you can from the lesson that makes you you think uh, uh, it is better to teach them uh, to teach the children uh, by this 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 so that that the way Okay, do you think the children like what you did? Okay, of course, huh? you, you must uh, be reliable that the children are, uh, 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 are happy or not. And then others thought of, of it. Okay, you, you can say anything about your, about your uh, lesson. Okay, 
So this is uh, the what the the, the 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 four parts of your assignment. Okay, remember if you want to write a uh, uh, reference, okay, make sure you use the the standard referencing uh, APA. Okay, yeah, that is. Okay, you, if you take it from the channels, you must write it like this: uh, online journal or website. Okay, books and other uh, sources. All right. I think uh, it is clear about your assignment. There are four parts. Can you remember, there are four parts. AI okay, uh, before I leave it. So we, I think, uh, it's better for you to 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 refresh again. Okay, part A, fifteen marks, four pages. What to do? You need to read the articles. What young children say about art. A comparative study. You need to read it first, at least two, two, three times to understand. Okay. Then what to do? Okay. Uh, you use this format: introduction, finding, and conclusion. If you want to have a better mark, I think I, uh, you better refer to what I uh, give you, give it to you. Okay. The purpose of the study: who is the author, the sample. The sample is meaning that is who is the respondent of the research, and how they collect the data. Okay. Firstly, what is the methodology? In any uh, academic research, it must it is a must to have a methodology. Okay, remember that thing. Either it's qualitative, quantitative, or, or mixed mode. Okay, then where is took place? Okay, and then what's the uh, the, 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 the author use for the col data collection? Eh? How they collect the data? Okay, either they use the instrument, a checklist, or uh, interview. Okay. Then how the how the author organize the data? How they the how the how the author use the data and describe it? Huh? Then for the finding, write about two and a half pages. Okay, what the what did the children say about the study? Okay, remember uh, you need to write an, uh, the conclusion about half a page. Okay, then for the part B, fifteen mark, four to five pages. The purpose of part B, you need to write a report okay a report there is no format for reports but you need to write it in a uh, any acceptable format okay so uh, for the part C remember okay write a letter of course it is a formal letter Explain why music activity should be important part of the curriculum. Give in some information to parents why it is important, and you need to yeah, and then you, you need to come up with the support uh, with uh, with the support research uh, research evidence. Okay, you maybe you can uh, add on some of the uh, the the SKP parts. Okay, maybe all right, and then the part D is uh, a lesson notes okay this is lesson notes okay lessons for teaching drawing for uh, two children so you need to to to, to use uh, any format as long as you're compatible with it okay so Thank you very much. Thank you. See you again in a uh, virtual class. Okay. Assalamualaikum.